channel. Today we've been sent some Beaker Creatures Liquid Reactor Super Lab by Learning Resources. So this looks loads of fun because you're releasing these little beaker creatures as you put the little fizz bomb into the water and that's like a little chemical reaction and that's kind of cool. So let's have a look inside. She didn't say it with me but that's okay. Okay, how do you open it? Oh, I feel like it's... Oh, is it? Is it like that? Yes, pull it up. No. Yes, it is. It says it's, it's age five plus. Okay. Okay, so in here... That's a very big... It looks like me. you have... Um, a instruction leaflet and a collector's manual. guide. So pass me that and I'll open it. <laughs> okay, so then we also have one of these experimental thingies. Oh, we don't need some Oh, glass but plastic cylinder, which I really like this one for some weird reason. And then we have some... Uh, oh, look at that! I don't think it's for that. I think it's to take the bath bomb out in the air. And then we also have... Make a mess over it. Give a mix of... Thing. We have another one of these. Oh, that's cool. Hi, you see like the twins. Okay, and then oh look. Okay, and then we have the bath bombs and another container. And open this. So they smell. I don't know if they smell, but they're in plastic, so I can't tell. Right. And then. We have an orange one and then a purple, get out, get out, get out. We have, okay, it's not gonna get out, but still, we have a purple one and one other container. Okay, just for the record, these things are not bathrooms. They're called alien eggs. And then inside this big tube, we have one syringe here, and then we have another syringe here, which equals two syringes. Now, right, and then we also have, Oh, oh, we also have this base. This base for all this. Oh, is these the bath bombs? No! They're alien eggs. So this is a little collector's guide. So it tells you all the little guys, the creatures that you can collect. Then you've got a little quiz. That tells you, so this is this is about Frostonians. No, it's not about that. So we've got Frostonians and how do you pronounce that? Bug netties. Buglitis, bug buglets. Buglet. That. <laughs> and then on the back of these, oh, on the back of these, it's a little mini poster. And we also have this. So this is for Frostonians. And this is for buglets. So I'm just wondering if that means. <gasps> hey, look! Look, that's the same colour, so that must mean we'll get a Frostonian in here and a buglet in here. So the instruction tells you how to assemble your liquid reactor, how to extract your beaker creature, sorry, and you can also make some experiments, different experiments, but you have to actually buy the ingredients. First of all, it tells me that I need to attach these two knobbly bits into these two pipes down here. And I'm going to do that now. Mm -hmm. So what would be useful is if you click this bit in first before you try to attach the rubber hoses. So then you can push them in and it stays still. Okay, so now it says it needs to put the two plastic syringes in. So is that a right noise? Okay, yeah, we're going to click one in there and do that one. Oh my goodness. What? I was doing that. There we go. Then you put the liquid reactor in the overflow tray. Okay, let's see if the syringes work. They're fine. So we've got to fill our conical flask with some water. Uh, okay, if you can see. Okay. And that's where we can use these to fill up the syringes. So we're gonna now do that. So how to do this is you twist it that way and then you put it up, you do the same, and then you put it in here. Oh wait, what? And you suck it up, like so. And then what, should we put it in here? But it's gonna go like, oh, right. You just clip it in. Yeah, there we go. Clip. Clip. What are you doing? So, so take, take the plastic, plastic off the egg and now we're going to drop it in the reactor. 
Oh, we have that. And now we're gonna squeeze in. Oh, this is so cool. That's enough. Oh, look. <gasps> Wait, get the stirry thing. We don't need the stir. I want the stirry thing. Oh, it's fizzing. <gasps> oh, look at that guy. It's a guy. Okay, so now we're taking the alien out. Hands on deck. No, that's what you do in a ship. Oh, oh, the alien acid's gone everywhere. Ah, red alert! Okay, so now I've got to pick up the alien acid, put it in here. No, it's in that, the alien, not the acid. Mm -hmm. And mix it around. We'll clean up the acid. The acid's over. Bye bye, acid. Okay, and now we're going to retake him out of here. Bye, acid. And he's now chemical free. And that's we need paper. Power. No, we, no, we don't. Oh, yeah. Okay, and then. Okay. You're gonna take Pop. the guy out and voila! So we've got Stuckley! He's really cute. So this guy has He's got three eyes. Suckers. He has like three little things on top of his head. He has six legs. He has like a kind of like a shell. So is he like supposed to be like, I'm wondering if he's a snail or a beetle. I think he's a beetle. He looks like a brain. So we're gonna suck the water out and then plunge it back in and see if we can make a whirlpool. We can't get it out. Okay, so there's our little buggy guy. He can see him. There we go. Hey, Mr. Buggy. Three, two, two one. <laughs> yeah. It reminds. It. I think it's more like a bubble machine. Like he's having like a little pool party there. There's the guy. Here he is. <laughs> we're gonna do a seriously dangerous experiment now. Because we're not going to change the water, we're going to mix two acids together and then buggy number two can be in two acids together. We have need to pull this out again because mm. then... Okay. Okay, right, so... Okay, okay. sounds like it's enjoying right. itself there. So people, off we go. go. <laughs> Uh, okay, it's kind of going like a brownie color. Ooh. Ew. Ew, I feel like I'm missing an alien brain. Ew, don't like, say that. That's kind of cool. The color's kind of cool. Look at this. Whoa. Right, there we go. Watch. Well, yeah, that's going to... Where's that's it gone? Gonna the there it is. Where the scissors? I'm going to have to put the line in with his little friend. I really want to like, pull it out to see what it looks like. Can we make it over No, here? no, 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 no. Pull it out. Oh my gosh. Well, wow. you're one interesting thing. So we're going to suck it out so we can show you what it looks like before it's all dissolving. Gosh, it's very hard getting these syringes off. Oof. There it is. Okay, so this guy. What does he feel like? He's like watery. Sandy. He feels sandy. Yeah. It's got all lumpy and fluffy and sandy yeah, like, like a proper alien, alien egg. It's like, what? It's really cool. So, so. We now We've clean added up. in clean of water. Clean and we are clean, clean water. Going to now so kill it. No, we're not going to kill it, but still. Oh, look, see, it's a nice colour now. It's it reminds me of like a Yeah. Why is it a bit of like a smoothie? Look, 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 guys, it's right there, you can see it. Right at the bottom. Right there. Look at that. Oh, it's so cool. I just want, I just want it to like, break. Or like, I just want it I have a bad crumble it. No, this, this alien guy. doesn't want to become an alien. So it just oh, won't. Oh, no, yeah, it does. No, look, we've decided, it. it's decided to, okay. to come out. Oh, wow. Okay. Okay. Put it in there. Okay. Mix him around. Get him out. Get him out. Get him out. Get him out. Open him up. Let's see which frustanium we have created. I hope it's Snowball, because I don't know. Who do we have? Snowball! This is a really fun way to find out which collector we have collected, or fizzed, or created. Come in like a cool collector specimen, specimen glass, so you could like put them back in there if you wanted to. And they could look like creatures stuck in a lab. You can use this set to create your own lotions and potions as well. You can use it to mix colours, like you could put 
um, yellow in here and orange in here and it could equal red and that would be really cool and these are really like it doesn't equal red but you know you, it does you get the idea guys but, and then these stupid. are really good containers because we're just playing in the bath and just mixing different concoctions that you've made together so what would be really cool is if you can make your own fizz bomb mixture and you can oh you could put the creatures egg. back inside the egg and you could re-fizz them yeah <laughs> Little kids are just absolutely gonna love this. You can put them, plunge these up and down. You can mix different colours of different You can play with the conical glass flasks. You can mix them and mash them. You can put stuff in here and then try and get them out. You can, it's, there's just like so much you can do with this. Thanks for watching our video. Don't forget to subscribe. And I'll see you next time. Bye.